Hi everybody, starting a new vlog, trying to get out from the parking space and I'm still sliding sideways because of the ice and uh, it's quite close, <laughs> you can see it. What the hell? You see? Almost, almost there. The only option for me now, I, I have some salt, I ask it inside and uh, right now I'm gonna try to move straight back to, get, to gain some more space, salt it in one more round and then try to move. Yay, I'm out. The salt worked. See, there's this lot of ice. And here the salt started working, it's melting. It's crazy. I was really close, but not actual touch. That's awesome. This time it's normal side potato. Good to go. It is almost 8 a.m. Midway rest area. Yesterday when I came here it was fully occupied, so I parked over there on the way out. I will show you later. After Woodstock, there is a pretty heavy snowfall started, and I actually even, how do you call it, uh, was upset that I decided to continue after Woodstock because it was enough time for me to get to, deli to delivery in two shifts after Woodstock. I mean, from Woodstock. But I decided to do a couple more hours to have some room. And uh, it was quite bad, so I was happy to stop. The guy just dropped his cigarette and went on. Forget. This is not my truck, I'm over there. And when I came here, it was absolutely free. There was no trucks. It's quite wide, even when I where I stand. Even if the another truck parks on this side, it's gonna be enough room to go through. But uh, everybody politely on the right side, so plenty of space to go. It's not so bad, but I have to clean some snow from there. I guess there is a bunch of snow on the trailer roof, but. I cannot do anything about it over here, so let's do what we can. location and already on the door even though my appointment was only for tomorrow morning they will actually take me in right now and uh, I will be empty in half an hour they have a washout so everything is awesome and I also know my next reload which is gonna be like about an hour away from here and uh, I just gonna go there today it is 4 20 p.m. I'm empty and already washed out the trailer so I'm gonna try to go to my next shipper maybe they will load me today maybe let's see that is my shipper they have only two dogs so both are occupied uh, on the back they have a scale so you scale in empty and scale out loaded and uh, I have two more hours driving left so I will be able to go to the truck stop once loaded, which is awesome. All right, it took a bit longer than I expected and uh, I'm already out of shift. So I'm gonna use a split slipper. 
so this way I get my hours back. It will be enough to get to, to a truck stop. I spent the night at High Peaks Rest Area, New York. Awesome place, awesome. It was quiet. Right now it's really beautiful. Just gonna wash my face and go on to the border. It's like an hour away from here. Melted snow pie. in Montreal again this time at Chipper I'm already here an hour and a half and uh, it looks like I will be here like at least three hours more so not good unfortunately I was right and the loading took this much long it's already 10 p.m. on the island so there is not much sense to go too far today and I have only three hours left of shift. I'm gonna go to Quebec City, the rest area over there, and uh, the rest for tomorrow. I got new windshield wipers, and the right side is not working at all. It is definitely not the worst snowstorm I've seen here. But uh, anyway, I decided to stop for today. I don't want to go to Nova Scotia's up and downs, hills, and uh, driving through this. So I will have enough time tomorrow morning to go to, the, to delivery on time. As usual, we need to get tested, and this is the line of people waiting to get tested as well. And it actually starts all the way from, almost from the traffic light. It's crazy. There was an outbreak in Summerside, so that's why it happens. The good thing is, truckers are going ahead of the line as essential workers. <laughs> 